Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Chris Chris Han. My Instagram is Chris Han XOXL. Today, as you can see, I am wearing my apron. Yes, I'm going to take you to my kitchen and show you something new, along with some easy recipes. So if you are a busy parent, if you are working from home, and this video will be perfect for you. Um, ever since we had a baby, my husband and I have been trying a lot of easy recipes at home. We basically um, cook every day at home, so we use the kitchen like so much. And we recently upgraded our kitchen appliances with this brand called By Dean and we got a very popular items like the cast iron Dutch oven, the automatic steamer, and their toaster. So everything is like very premium, most importantly Instagram worthy. So it totally lifted my mood for cooking. So without further ado, let's go to the kitchen. Today we're gonna steam dim sum, make avocado toast, and make a stir-fried shrimp with rice noodle. So let's start with the dim sum. This is By Dean Digital Food Steamer. To assemble, just put the parts into the steamer. Energy generated ring, drip tray, steaming tray, and ceramic plate. It's compact and very easy to use. And the last part is the stainless steel lid. As you can see, this is very easy to assemble and clean. Now I can add water from the two openings on both sides. There is a little screen on the right side to monitor the water level, so it's very safe and convenient. We already got some dim sum from the market. These char siu bombs and shumai dumplings are my favorites. Place the plate onto the steaming tray and close the stainless steel lid. It's ready to steam. And then press start button and turn the knob to 15 minutes. You can see the setting from this screen. This is very straightforward. This steamer is very versatile. You can steam, stew, disinfect, and make yogurt with it. Steaming is actually a great way to preserve the nutrition in the food. Very easy and very healthy. It also has two stew pots for you to make stews. This steamer is automatic. You don't have to worry about water getting dried up during the cooking. I just love this feature. So when it's steaming, you don't have to keep an eye on it. You can just do your things and come back after 15 minutes. And you don't see a lot of steamed water out of the lid, which is very nice. Okay, time is up. 15 minutes. Now we can open the lid and enjoy our dim sum. So the food is steaming hot. You want to be really careful. I would highly recommend this By Dean digital steamer if you like steamed food. For us, this will be perfect. We love steamed food for breakfast and sometimes dinner too. And I also make some baby food with this steamer. Most importantly, this is very versatile, very easy to use and clean. Um, so I would highly recommend this one. And then let's make the toast. This is an easy one. We're gonna use the Bai Dean for a slide toaster. I'll just use butter white bread for a crunchy and flavorful taste today. Look at this beautiful toaster. This can heat regular toast, bagel, and muffin. It also comes with defrost and reheat functions. For browning control, you can easily adjust with the knob. I'm just gonna use in level one for very slight browning. Insert the toasts into the slots and press the handle to start. The slots are wide enough for thick cuts. I really enjoy the buttery smell in the air when it's heating. This recipe is like my everyday. For this avocado toast, the bread is definitely the hero. So you want to make sure the toast is done right. You can layer whatever ingredients, whatever toppings you like on top of the smashed avocado. The toasts are ready. Take the two slices out and look at the browning. This is exactly what I wanted for today's recipe. On top of the avocado, I'll just add some baby spinach and a poached egg. Season it with salt and black pepper. So this is done. This is the taste of freshness. The next food we're gonna cook together is stir fry shrimp with rice noodle using biting Dutch oven. This is a very classic Dutch oven recipe. And here are the ingredients. This Dutch oven is so beautiful and sleek. The cast iron heats quickly and evenly. 
add some oil and stir fry the shrimps first. This Dutch oven is perfect for all stove tops and oven. It's very easy to cook, very easy to clean and maintain. You can braise, bake, fry, and do a lot more with this. So inside of the oven, it has enamel coating, so it's not sticky. The food is always juicy and moist. Keep stir frying the shrimps until both sides turn red, and add the minced ginger, garlic, and green onion. I like the smell of all these ingredients, and they make the shrimps very flavorful. The Dutch oven heats quickly, so you might want to adjust the heat when you're cooking. For the fresh ingredients, I add more cooking oil. You can skip this part or add less if you want. And mix it with the sauce, which is a mixture of seafood sauce, soy sauce, and sugar. The seafood sauce sometimes can be a little bit sticky, but with this enamel coating inside of this Dutch oven, it's not very sticky at all. And then add rice noodles. You can mix it well with the sauce and all the ingredients. To make the noodles soft and moist, you can add some water and mix all the ingredients with the rice noodle. Turn up the heat and bring it to boiling. And then you can add the lid and let it braise for 5 minutes using medium to high heat. And you can check the texture of the food. You can stir the food and add a few more minutes if necessary. When it's all done, you can add some garnishing for tasting. I like cilantro and green onion. They look beautiful. This is an easy and a delicious shrimp recipe that we really love. Since we are already using a Dutch oven, so we're gonna serve as is. The Dutch oven looks nice for the table and it also retains the heat. Dutch oven is great for a lot of different recipes. This is a very nice investment for everybody's kitchen. If you'd like to see more Dutch oven recipes, you can leave a comment in the comment section. Okay, so these are some of the foods that I want to share with you guys. As you can see, we have a wide range of like different foods in our recipe. And we are in LA, we enjoy Californian food, healthy and easy. And also we're Chinese, we enjoy anything from Asia. Asian fusion, Chinese food, you just name it, everything is just like so yummy. And with buying appliances, I mean the cooking experience has been elevated. I enjoy these appliances. Honestly, this is the best I have ever tried. So if you guys are ever interested in picking up anything from Baiding, I have the links in the description down below. You can go from there. Let me know if you have any questions. Um, use the comment section down below or DM me on Instagram at Chris Han XOXO. So that's it for today. Thank you so much, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!